We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. A good matchup here for you tonight between the Seattle Mariners and the Oakland A's. It's A's Baseball coming up next. Now in the box, J.J. Watt. A couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. The one-two. Grounded down the third baseline. Ray. Throw just does beat him to the bag as that was pretty close. Into the box now, Gerald Hayden. It was a three-hit effort from him last night, so he was a big part of that victory. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Fouled away. Bases are empty here with two men out. Smoked on the ground up the middle, and that's through for a hit. Man, you smoked that ball. That a boy. And you see on the graphic right there that his hitting streak will indeed live on as he just continues to hit the ball well. Yeah, he certainly has. He's seeing the ball so big, Matty. You see the confidence oozing off him in the box. He hasn't fished at anything in the last month or so. So I don't expect this to go away anytime soon. Mark, what? Little chopper back to the mound. Come on, Throw come on, on come to come first on, gets on, him on, and the side on. is retired. One left for Oakland. Still no score. Standing in, Gerald Hayden. He singled his last time up. Yeah, Matty, pressure's off right now. He extended his hitting streak that last plate appearance. Now he gets to get back into his zone, work on his craft, and try and drive something in the gap. And he lays off there 1-0. Hayden, a California native, actually. He was selected in the 15th round during the 2020 draft. What an absolute steal. I mean, he's, this guy has gotten a lot of people some big raises in the organization. To be drafted as low as he was and turned himself into one of the biggest superstars in our sport. I am very impressed with what this guy's been able to do. Striding forward now, now is the DH, Arturo Montalvo. Arturo Montalvo. Down here and he'll try to beat it out. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. Stepping up to the plate, William Tuffman. 0 for 2 with a couple of strikeouts for him so far. Here it comes, 0 and 2. He's down to third. Throw on to first, and they're able to escape the monster inning as the side is retired. So it's two runs on four base hits. No errors and a couple of men left on. To the bottom of inning number four we go. The Mariners are on top, two to nothing. Hey, you be right here. Digging One in time. the switch hitter, base, Gerald Hayden. As the switch hitter Gerald. will take his cuts left-handed hey, here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. Now here's a fly ball, well hit. Center fielder looking up, still going back. And that one is gone! Solo shot to right center, number 18 for him on the campaign, as that'll pull him even at four apiece. Ready once again, Gerald Hayden. Third baseman, number yeah, two. that last at bat, Daddy, he Gerald. turned that fastball around. He Hayden. didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But hey, listen, a home run is a home run. 
Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Long run for the center fielder. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Well, there's another save, but that's just not any other save. That's save number 50 for the reliever in his career, well on his way to a nice career. This evening's game comes to an end, 5-4, the final tally. Oakland jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Cesar Vega earns his third win of the year in relief. Connor Casado closes the door for the save, his ninth of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.